Hello, my name is Jack Valance and welcome to my vlog Consumer Me, where I'll be considering my purchase behaviour when buying trainers for both lifestyle and performance use. Appropriate footwear is a basic human requirement and need which can be fulfilled at a relatively low price, so why is there still wants and demands for high-end brands such as Adidas and Nike, which are considered more leisurely items rather than a necessity? As of recent years, Adidas have been my personal choice of brand when purchasing trainers. They are a high value brand which aim to offer a high quality service and product which expectedly comes at a higher price than some other brands. However, despite the high price and high expectations that come with it, I have always been fully satisfied with the performance of the purchases that I have made. The decision making process that I go through when purchasing a new pair of trainers begins with problem recognition, such as my current trainers becoming worn and beginning to break. Once I have recognised the problem, I will begin my information search into potential new pairs of trainers which I could purchase. I will usually do this by browsing online or visiting stores such as Sports Direct, JD Sports or Foot Asylum. Once I have carried out my information search, I will go on to evaluate any alternatives such as Nike trainers before making my final decision and product choice of Adidas trainers. The outcome of this has always been that the product has then satisfied my needs and wants. When I purchase new trainers, it tends to be a limited problem solving buying situation. This is because it's a less frequent purchase, however it's still moderately expensive and requires a deliberate decision process. Despite this, there is still limited risk. Since they are a relatively expensive and infrequent purchase, I tend to have a high consumer involvement when making my decision on which trainers to buy. In addition to this, since they are an item of clothing, they will have social visibility and give off a symbolic meaning, adding to the importance that I make the correct decision when buying my product. So what are the main influences that make me choose Adidas over any other brand? Well, Adidas as a company are driven by the trends and preferences of their consumers and they cater to their main audience of health conscious buyers. They are constantly changing the designs of their products to match the changing interests of their consumers. They have multiple products which appeal to any age, gender or lifestyle demographic. Adidas also supports worldwide events such as the World Cup and the Olympics which enables them to display their products to new audiences. In addition to this, Adidas work with professional athletes to optimise the performance of their products for their consumers. From a technological point of view, Adidas support online sales through their website and their social media pages. From an environmental perspective, Adidas decrease environmental impact by using natural materials in their products and eliminating any hazardous substances. They also ensure that the suppliers around the world are manufacturing their products and are following any business regulations. Let's consider my main motivations to purchase Adidas products after these factors have influenced me. On the one hand, you could say that my motivations are more leaning towards esteem factors rather than physiological and the need to be respected by myself and others for wearing a high-end brand. On the other hand, you could say that my motivations are from the self-concept that I am an active and health-conscious person and I purchase Adidas products to represent these characteristics. That concludes my Consumer Me vlog. I hope you enjoyed watching and have a better understanding of my purchase behaviour as a consumer. Here are the references to any relevant information which I use to help produce this vlog, along with the image sources for the images that you have seen. Thank you for listening.